were so afraid, and the angel said unto them, Fear not, for the Lord I bring the good tidings of great joy, which shall be to all people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, which is Christ the Lord. And this shall be a sign unto you. Ye shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling and clothes, lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude, a multitude of heavenly hosts praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, good will toward men. And it came to pass, as the angels were gone away from them into heaven, the shepherds said one to another, Let us now go even unto Bethlehem, and see this thing which is come to pass, which the Lord hath made known unto us. And they came in haste, and found Mary and Joseph and the babe lying in a manger. And when they had seen this thing, they had known abroad the same which is told them concerning this child. And all they that heard it wondered at those things which are told them by the shepherds. But Mary kept all these things and wondered them in her heart. And the shepherds returned. Glorifying and praising God for all the things that they had heard and seen, as it was told unto them. Now, when Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea in the days of Herod the king, behold, there came wise men from the east to Jerusalem, saying, Where is he that is born king of the Jews? For we have seen his star in the east. And I come to worship him. When Herod the king had heard these things, he was troubled, and all Jerusalem with him. And when he had gathered all the chief priests and scribes of the people together, he demanded of them that Christ should be born. And they said unto him in Bethlehem of Judea, For thus is written by the prophet. And now Bethlehem and the land of Judah art not in the last among the princes of Judah. For out of thee shall come a governor that shall rule my people of Israel. Then Aaron, whom he had privily called the wise men, inquired of them diligently what time the star appeared. And he sent them to Bethlehem and said, Go and search diligently for the young child. And when ye have found him, bring me, bring me word again, that I come and worship him also. When they had heard the king, they departed, and lo, the star which they saw in the east went before them till it came and stood over where the young child was. When they saw the star, they rejoiced with exceeding great joy. And when they were coming to the house, they saw the young child with Mary his mother, and fell down and worshipped him. And when they had opened their treasures, they presented unto him gifts, gold, and frankincense, and myrrh. And being warned of God in a dream that they should not return to Herod, they departed into their own country another way. And when they were departed, behold, the angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream, saying, Arise and take the young child and his mother and flee into Egypt, and be thou until I bring thee word, for Herod will seek the young child and destroy him. When he arose, he took the young child and his mother one night and departed into Egypt.
did you know that your baby boy would say for sons and daughters? Did you know that your baby boy has come to make you new? This child that you delivered will soon deliver you. Maybe did you know that your baby boy would give sad to Did you know that your baby boy would calm a storm with his hand? Did you know that your baby boy has walked where angels trod? When you kiss your little baby, you've kissed the face of God. The blind will see, the deaf will hear, the dead will rise again. The lame will leap, the dumb will speak, the praises of the Lamb. Mary, did you know that your baby boy is Lord of all creation? Did you know that your baby boy is heaven's perfect lamb? And the sleeping child you're holding is the great.